Oh, sorry, I didn't realize it was still going. Hi, guys. How are you today? So, as promised on... I'm trying to plug my phone. So, as promised on my stream, I said that I would be unpicking my Rapunzel Square blanket. And before you yell and get all upset... I started this a long time ago, when I first started Corner to Corner, so, how old am I, like, this was seven years in the making, like, look at this yarn, just, take a gander at it, it's like, it probably smells too, oh, actually, no, it doesn't, it's not, it doesn't smell that bad. So I didn't know how to do color changes. Like, look how loose the stitches are. So I'm going to get this out and we'll take a better look at it. So obviously you're, I'm not going to be able to show the whole thing because it is big. But just by looking at it, look how rough the bottom is. I'm going to try to hold it still. Like, it's not even... It's not even straight. And it looks like I started to decrease, actually. But even that isn't straight at all. It's all bunched up. And if you look here, you can see what I was saying about the color changes and how I didn't understand them. The stitches don't line up. Yeah. And it's just bunched up in general. Like... And just the color changes are really bad. So that's one of the reasons why I decided to unpick it. And the other thing is, I don't even have the pattern for this anymore. This was on a really old laptop of mine, and I don't have access to it anymore. Somewhere in the process, it got deleted or something like that. I'm not exactly sure. So, yes, I could probably just find the pattern again, but I would want to do it in my skill set now. Because if I was to, if I was to continue with it now, I don't feel like it would be my best work. I feel like it would just be a waste of yarn, honestly. Because... I did this when I was so young. I have no regrets. It was a project I did want to do. It's just I never got around to it. And it wasn't in my skill set. At the time. To create a graph GAN. So. Yeah. Those are a few reasons why I decided to undo this. And repurpose the yarn. Into something else. Because I currently don't have. The funds to buy more yarn so I gotta make do what I got you know because all my money is going towards bills and college and money's just a little tight right now if you want to donate by the way link will be down below um <laughs> but no you don't feel you don't feel obligated to donate or anything just yeah those are a few reasons why I decided to undo it and I'm just not happy with it. And it's been sitting in my drawer. And every single time I look at it. I'm like what am I going to do with this? And you know. I, I feel like this is the best bet. Just try to save as much yarn as I can. And find a different project to use it on. Because as you don't know. I Well actually you probably do know. I have a lot of whips. I believe I made a video on it on YouTube. I think I did. I'm not, I don't exactly remember because I make a lot of videos. <laughs> so I think I made a video on it. If not, I have like over 30, honestly. And I'm not, ha I'm not proud about it. So now I can repurpose this yarn and it will be one less whip to worry about. That and I already have this yellow connected to a different project the harry potter graph hands corner corners that i've been working on st on the stream actually use of this yellow i think i believe it's the same yellow 
it might not be so not exactly sure now it I know it looks like it's gonna take a while because it's a tangled mess but once I detangle them the first time it it won't be as hard because a lot of these colors are only used in like one spot I think Once I get through them, be a lot easier. And we'll just take it one color at a time. We'll get to that color. We'll wind it up. We'll unpick it, wind it up, and then, yeah, we'll detangle it after. And then re-roll. Okay. So now it's this color. So let me go ahead and grab this bowl. This is a much bigger bowl. So this one might be a little hard to detangle. Oh, maybe not. for the purple there's a lot of this purple so might take a few minutes tomorrow's video is going to be about the Steven Universe movie and there are going to be spoilers so go ahead and watch it if you haven't <laughs> you will not regret it at all it is the best movie No, I, I know I say that a lot about, about a lot of movies, but this movie is in, like, I don't know. I wouldn't even, like, an anime. It's a cartoon, like, it's based off a cartoon. So I'm pretty sure it's still, like, a cartoonish movie. It's not live action or anything, but in the cartoon genre thing, this is by far the best. My top anime one so far, currently, has to be uh, Spider-Verse. And, uh, Far From Home. Those are my favorites currently. Look, I didn't even do the corner, the, <gasps> you know how I was trying to do the, like the edging, the decrease, I didn't even do it right. <laughs> it's sad. I don't, I don't even have another ball of blue, do I? Oh, yeah, here it is. All these blues are the same, by the way, but it's really cute. It's actually... I don't want to move it, but... It is... Oh, it's going to fall. Ah! Okay. It's not the same color as my Dobby. 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 Harry Potter thing. Square. <laughs> I mean, at the first glance, it looked like it might be close, but it's not. And it's about, it's like near the same color, but it's like a different tone. This one's darker. But on the bright side, I'm going to have a lot of yarn for my, if I can't find a project, my scrap blanket. This is a weird tan color. I started using this one because this was the only tan they had before I found my, my new tan that I now currently use. Which is, uh, I'll grab it in one second. Let me finish the purple. Okay, we'll roll this up. It's 
So this is the tan I was using originally for like skin. But this is the tan I use now. This one's like more natural skin. This is like a golden skin. Like someone who's got a tan on their bod. <laughs> Probably for the camera shaking. This one's a lot easier than I thought though, so that'd be a lot harder. Probably should have measured how big it was. That would have been nice. Okay, guys. Well, I hope you do, you enjoyed this unpicking Rapunzel video thing. I won't be live tomorrow, but I will be live on Friday. So, thank you so much, guys, and have a great day.